Because it's personal. It's personal. Porque esto es personal. Because it's personal. It's personal. It's personal. Because this is personal. This disease clearly affects everyone, but it affects our vulnerable populations even more. When I think about Levi Arnold, he and his lovely wife, he brought me this platter. You don't have a full plate. You have a platter. I never expected that he would be dead from this virus. This is my son, Mark Jones, my better half. For him to have to take care of his wife with the coronavirus and the, his mother at the same time, I tell him all the time, you're a remarkable son, Mark. This is our chance to reinvent how we care for those that are having the hardest time. And this is our chance to make sure wellness is not related to your checkbook, is not related to your Rolodex, is not related to who you know and what you can pay for. It's related to us being New Orleanians that all deserve the right of good health. También quiero compartirles que mi mamá fue positiva en el coronavirus. Ella tiene todas las indicaciones, tiene 72 años. When I was hospitalized and I saw somebody actually that passed away, that's when the, the realization, hey, this is some serious stuff. I'm, I'm a spiritual person. I, I mean, I believe in God. So I just felt like I had, to, I had to push myself. I spent 10 days in the hospital. I quarantined myself for extra week to make sure that I was straight and it's been 21 days of symptoms for me. I don't really feel like I'm on the other side of anything. I mean, with a history of asthma, your worst fear is not being able to breathe. It's, it's really scary. I thought I was gonna die. I wouldn't be able to see my daughter and my granddaughter again. That's what I thought. Stay home, except for essential needs. Wear face covering in public. Get tested if you feel sick. Por favor, esté seis pies lejos de la otra persona. Get help if you need it. And for sure, help your neighbors in need. Because this is personal. <laughs>